Okay. Um, I'm, you, you'll see me sideways, and I'm really sorry about that, but I'm shooting on an iPad, and I have the worst setup ever right now, but it works. So here we go. I'm going to start by drawing in the um, shape of his head. Wait, okay. Okay, so there's his head shape, and um, I will be fine lining later, and I'll erase all of those, but for now we'll just keep working. Now, um, now I'm going to draw in his hair, and get the idea that um, he wears his hair down and it covers his eyes, so, and in my style of drawing, hair always ends with like a triangle if you see what I mean it ends in like that point then I'm gonna go in and add more strands of hair between these like that put in his mouth and his nose I feel like I'm talking like a kindergarten teacher. <laughs> okay, like that. So they're um, not really all that difficult. Here I'm gonna add in some de weird like details in his skin because he's android. So his skin is artificial, so like those little dots there, those are screws. I think, okay, sorry about that. I'm running out of memory on my iPad. So, but I'll get this video done. So I gotta work quickly, so sorry about that. I'm gonna use this color blue. color for his skin um, and this color for the implantations in his skin okay now first these are his highlights continuing on um, like I said earlier I'm losing memory on this thing 16 gigabytes, yeah right. So now I'm going in and I'm just filling in the rest of the area and kind of You can definitely do these with other markers or even colored pencils as well, but I choose to use these markers. coloring in the rest because it doesn't need to have that swishy effect until the top and like the bottomish area. Okay. Next, I'm going to do a skin. Now, skin is really weird because these markers do a little like streaky thing. So I just pretty much outline Skin and the shadow areas. And then around here and 
just make it look like a really intense shadow. Now with this, I'm also going to put a little bit of it in his hair. But then I just trace over this. Then I'm going to fine line it using the fine tip of this marker. There you have it. That's how you draw my character. Um, thanks for watching. And I'll be back again sometime with probably another drawing tutorial.